away and running in this 5,000 metre championship. Liam Adams, Cameron Page, Stephen Deneen and Harry Summers, the four athletes. As I mentioned in the introduction, Harry Summers, the bronze medalist from the 10,000 metre championship held at the Zatapec meeting. Sitting in second place at the moment behind Cameron Page from New South Wales and Liam Adams, Victoria's Liam Adams, a world cross country representative on four occasions for Australia. Just settling down into a good early pace. Just be aware please, field athletes, that the uh, 5,000 metre men are going around the track. So Page, it looks to be doing a turn of pace at the front here for these two athletes in Summers and Liam Adams. Deneen has just dropped away early. Going to go through 400 in a fairly fast tempo. So the clock's just ticking over 62, 63 seconds at the moment. So Page is clearly on a schedule of uh, 65 seconds, which will give them a time around about 13.30. So this is very fast running in the early stages of the men's 5,000 metre championship. So Summers still leading the way, eight laps to go. Men's 5,000 metres, 4.55 on the clock with eight laps to go. Liam Adams still within striking distance. Steve Deneen now moved up into third position. Looks like we may have lost our athlete in Cameron Page. Five twenty nine twenty six at two kilometres for Harry Summers. Pace is really on here. Adams still got Harry Summers in his sights. Both these athletes well credentialed. Thirteen forty five pace currently for Harry Summers. We saw an exciting five thousand metre Olympic Games trials with. Uh, Collis Birmingham and Craig Mottram going head to head. Mottram taking the victory on that occasion and booking his spot on the Olympic team. Both these athletes were in that race, left in the wake of Mottram and Birmingham on that occasion, but certainly putting on a display here in the men's 5,000 metres. So the 4,000 metre split about to be displayed, 11 minutes 11 for Harry Summers, our leader. Trying gallantly to hang on is Liam Adams. 30 to 40 metres adrift of Summers. 1K to go, they're through the tough part of the 3,000. From 3,000 to 4,000, really sets up a time here. Summers was on 13.30 pace early, is still under the 14 minute barrier at this stage. We'll come down to get the call of two laps to go. Harry Summers, Adams trying to work hard. Trying to bridge the gap that Summers has opened up right from the start. Victoria's Steve Deneen is about to come into the straight. So our leader in the men's 5,000 metre, Harry Summers, coming past the main grandstand for the second last time. 
Let's get right behind him, ladies and gentlemen. He's been a brave display of front running here. He's going to get that welcome sound of the bell. 400 metres to travel in the 5,000. Just under 13 minutes at the bell, so a strong last lap. We'll see him get under 14 minutes. Liam Adams from Victoria gets the call of one to go. This margin's been about the same for the last three to four laps. Summers will certainly have to raise his efforts to get under 14 minutes. Worked very hard from kilometre one through to about kilometre three. Adam's trying to lift his efforts to get a good time on the board. Summers still in front with 200 to run and Steve Deneen gets the bell, one to go. So Harry Summers getting some support from the uh, spectators there at the water jump. As he goes around, he's going to get himself a national title as Harry Summers from the New South Wales. Big round of applause here for Harry Summers, ladies and gentlemen. Brave display of front running. An all the way victory to Harry Summers, New South Wales. And a great finish from Liam Adams. Really found something in the last lap there. Harry Summers goes through 14.03, the winning time for Harry Summers. And Liam Adams takes silver in the national title. And keep that applause going for Victoria's Steve Deneen. 14.30 on the clock now as Deneen finishes off strongly. So Steve Deneen from the Box Hill Club here in Victoria comes down to the line to receive his bronze medal. Great performance.